we are here with Steve Morris, Dana Point Shipyard. So Steve, tell us a little bit about the shipyard and the history of the yard itself here. Uh, shipyard history, I mean, we've been here since uh, 1971. Uh, family owned and operated since 67. Uh, started in the uh, Newport Back Bay. And then uh, our grandfather got the lease on this uh, piece of property when the harbor opened. We've put every improvement in on the property, um, done a couple of sets of docks, a couple of sets of piers. Um, we just purchased this new lift in 2017, um, gave us the capacity to do 25 foot uh, on the beam and uh, 200,000 pounds on the displacement. Uh, it's really opened up our uh, demographic of customer, which has been great. Um, I've been here since I've been 13. Uh, every oh, every geez. summer in between, uh, you know, sixth and seventh grade, uh, every summer, and then I graduated early and uh, started going to Cal State Fullerton. Was working here full time and uh, never left. And uh, basically, uh, my brother and I, Jason, we run the company now, and um, you know, working with Aaron on these black fins and uh, trying to move some uh, some new uh, new black fins. Very good, very good. And tell us a little bit about about the uh, the basic functions and uh, that you guys do here at the yard for for your clients. I mean, uh, something as probably simple as is basic engine maintenance yep. to fiberglass work gets yeah. done here. Yeah. So we basically do everything from yeah bottom paint, through haul work, shafting, running gear, cutlass bearings, underwater lights, um, sea chest, telescoping transducers, um, all kinds of sonar equipment. Um, bow, uh, bow thrusters, stern thrusters, uh, sea keeper stabilizers. Um, we're a Mercury Premier dealer. Uh, we're the only V12 outboard dealer for Mercury uh, that's certified to work on a V12 in the area. Um, we're a Cummins dealer also, a Yanmar dealer. Um, we've got five certified techs. We've got probably 15 you know, yard staff, uh, shipwright kind of guys. Um, yeah, so I mean, we do we do basically everything on the boat. We don't do details. We subcontract that. We don't do upholstery, canvas work. We subcontract that stuff. But basically everything else: uh, hull paint, bottom paint, topside paint, gel coat, um, big fiberglass repairs, structural repairs, repowers, converting from an inboard to uh, or a stern drive to an outboard. We can do that no problem. Um, converting from gas to diesel, we can do that. We're doing a repower on a 29 Tierra right now with uh, twin Yanmars, the, uh, the new uh, 250s, um, pulled out a pair of Cummins. So we, we pretty much uh, run the gamut on uh, anything boat related. Uh, we can get it done. So how about um, when somebody uh, needs something that you, that you have to sub out, uh, do you give the client uh, uh, contacts or recommendations of uh, people yeah. to do certain work? We, we have certain vendors that we work with uh, over the years, kind of built relationships. So we can kind of manage that transition or our transaction, or we can give that information to the client doesn't matter doesn't matter to us I mean we're gonna make a little bit of money if we're you know managing the transaction and we're kind of bringing these people in um, if we just give them the number and they do it at their slip it's fine uh, we don't have a problem um, like I said we've built this kind of network of subcontractors that uh, we feel are very good and and maintain our level of quality so we like to work with those uh, with those vendors but we could do it either way we, we we can manage it or we can give it to the, the customer to manage how about insurance work do you guys uh, mm -hmm. do you guys accept insurance work or? yeah yeah so the last one we just did is this uh, 42 catamaran right over here um, he broke loose from a mooring in uh, Catalina and uh, put a hole in it about this big oh, and wow. uh, he put some plywood on it some marine techs and uh, <laughs> he was an old client of ours and so he brought it over and uh, we're working with his insurance to get the hole fixed and he was afraid they were gonna total the boat uh, for the amount of work it was uh, that was needed and uh, we were able to to work on the price and get it to a point where he didn't have to total it we can get it repaired back to its uh, you know normal uh, uh, functionality and um, we're almost done with that one um, so yeah absolutely do insurance work work with insurance carriers yeah so but uh, we we allow the boat owner to kind of drive the repair so we work for the boat owner at the end of the day sure so if the boat owner says I want to do this then that's what we do um, now we'll work with the insurance company we'll give them estimates we'll tell them why it takes this or what this or whatever we need to do but at the end of the day we work for the boat owner right yeah. and then um, you know you know with insurance when somebody's buying a new boat or is in the process of 
maybe buying a new used boat for themselves. Sure. Um, there's there's always that, you know, I need an out of water survey done. Mm -hmm. Those are things that people can come to you. Is Absolutely. there a long is there a long period uh, waiting time? Like if, like if I needed a survey. How, today, how soon would it be able to, to get it get it out, out of the water and looked at? Yeah, we could. Uh, we're usually scheduling those like a week in, a, uh, in advance. Okay, perfect. Um, so yeah, we work with a ton of different brokers and they'll, they'll call us up and I mean, at any given time, we probably have five or six surveys a week on the schedule, Got on it. the calendar. Um, some of them fall off, but um, you know, most of them, you know, stay on there. So yeah, we usually do it at about 11 o'clock. We, we bring the boat in, we haul it out, we hang it right here. The uh, hull surveyor gets down here, he takes a look at everything, the, the buyers here, the sellers here usually. And then the boys will go to lunch at 12, <laughs> and then, uh, you know, 12.30, they're usually done, and then we mm. put them back in the water. And that's all basically done right in this area yeah. right here anyway. Yeah, yeah, right here so. on our travel with pad, we, we uh, just kind of, we kind of short block it, if you will. We mm -hmm. put some uh, keel stands on it and, um, you know, set that down and just so it's stable for everybody. And then they crawl around, look at the bottom, do what they got to do. Um, and then, you know, if we're hired to do the mechanical portion of the surveys, we'll usually do that a day or two ahead of time. We'll do oil samples and, and stuff like that on bigger diesels. Sure. Um, you, we'll usually pull oil samples on the mains, the trannies, and the, uh, and the gen sets. Got it. Yeah, send those out. Perfect. Wow, so it's a it's an all-in-one uh, shop here for you guys. I mean, you guys are able to really kind of get everything done for the for the client. I Absolutely. Mean, nice. I'll tell you guys, it's a very nice, clean yard. There's, you know, everything is really spick and span here. So we, we definitely uh, we take pride in what we do, and we take pride in our work. We uh, we definitely believe in quality work uh, over anything else. So. Yeah. Um, over price, over time. I know that's unfortunate, and I know that's kind of a, a stickler for people. But I'm not going to rush something to do something less quality. Yeah, you're not going to um, cut corners. No. So yeah. if it just takes the time, it just takes the time. Sure. And uh, if 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 we're meeting our high level of expectations, then I'm happy. Perfect. Um, so the same goes with the yard. You know, we we like it clean. We we like to have uh, all of our trash bins. We like to. We like to keep it clean. We like to keep it organized because we're just more productive that way. Sure. Uh, we're more efficient that way. We're more productive, and we can serve the needs of our clients the best way possible uh, in, in that uh, in that fashion. So. All right, man. All right. Thanks, man. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Appreciate yep. your time. Yep. This is a great place. Take care. Thank you.